this is my article on the Raspberry Pi AI kit. I recently acquired it. Now, uh, looking around me, yeah, I did this. Uh, let me put my camera on screen, sorry. Uh, a while ago, I got the Raspberry Pi hat, the M.2 hat, which enables me to plug in a, an SSD and boot from the SSD, which is great. The only downside here is that the M.2 hat is single lane PCI Express only. So this plugs into the Raspberry Pi's PCI port. And uh, being single lane, you either run an SSD or you run uh, something like a Halo AI accelerator, which is exactly what I'm doing here. This is it. This is the Raspberry Pi AI kit. Focus that right there. Mm -hmm. And it's running and it's connected. And I've got a camera up and running. And it's actually running object detection on the screen here, but I fear that this camera may not zoom in far enough for this, but we'll try this. Action cam did not like to be moved. Okay, so now the command that I last used, and uh, Saad, you mentioned uh, using, I used OpenCV last time I experimented, and you said that YOLO was better because you had more experience with YOLO and it seemed to work better. And I see that that seems to be the default for the Halo kit. So this one is using the YOLO 5 inference model. And if I pull that up and you can see the detection up and running, that is what the camera is seeing now. So if I hold some things up, yeah, um, it's not 100% accurate, but my hand is a person. Yeah, so you got that right. That's a person. Let's have a look at my cell phone. Is it detected? Yep, it's got cell phone there and it can detect keyboard. There you go. That's interesting. And what I want to actually do is it's all very well sitting at the desktop detecting uh, these things that we use all the time in our offices. But I'd like to take it out in the field and try some things such as number plate recognition. You know, if you're running, if you're living, say, in a complex like I am, it might be interesting for, say, security to see. Uh, privacy considerations aside, but you are running the security of the complex to see who's coming in, who's going out, you know, so you've got complete logs. If there is an incident, you can see what cars came in and out, that sort of thing. Uh, I'm sure there are other applications. For example, you could take it out into the street or, uh, you know, monitor traffic or see who's breaking laws or what sort of speeds people are doing or what laws they are breaking. Are they uh, making right turns more often? at the left turn uh, lane, that sort of thing. I'm, I'm interested in that, but uh, I'd be keen to hear from you guys what sort of applications you think would be useful out in the field.